Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name's Pierre and this is Simple Home Brew. I'm doing this video because I have time. I'm waiting for my sparge water to boil or get to, get to temperature. Uh, I'm making a VB clone at the moment again, but this is an all grain one. Uh, look, I did an unboxing in the last video, so if you want to check it out, have a look in the captions up here, uh, in the cards up here. Today, I'm doing a West City Brewing Company, or Brewing, West City Brewing White Ale. I've got the picture from their website. This is up here on the screen. It's a 4.9% white ale. It's 440 mil. Uh, there's not much of a depiction on what it's made of and what's in it. It just says on the can, uh, a, a traditional Belgian blonde ale with a solid wheat backbone, the fresh coriander seeds, orange zest, and new world hops deliver a delicious hazy ale with a twist. I know I've read that slow. I'm really struggling with these glasses. I really need to upgrade my glasses. <laughs> it's funny though. Uh, just as a story, in, just recently I have, uh, where I work, it's been taken over by a corporate company and I now have been, my role there has changed a little. So a lot of my life in the last few weeks has been quite, quite busy and stressful. So if you see strange videos and me being a bit tired, that's because I'm flat out at the moment. But anyway, let's try this beer. Cheers guys for watching by the way. And I like, again, I'd like to welcome, welcome Gavin to my Patreon. So I open her up. Whoop, I didn't shake that. That happens at last time too. Okay, sorry guys. We shall pour that and see what it looks like. Damn. That is, that is very, very car highly carbonated, that one. Look, that's unreal. Oh, lots of carbonation in this. Look at that. That poured terribly. I'll let that settle and I'll come back to you on that one. All right, the bubbles have settled a little bit. Pour that slow so I don't get too much of a foam up. All right, I'll give you a look at that. Got a bit of haze to it. Of course, there must have been stuff on the bottom of the glass, but we'll show you. There's our beer. Not bad. Looking a bit, I like the backdrop. It looks really good, doesn't it? So it's a hazy white ale, so it's pretty hazy. Got a lot of carbonation in it, as you can tell, when I poured it. I'll give it a scent or smell. Well, I'm getting that um, citrusy. Wow, um, what am I smelling? Hard to, obviously beer, but that's fine. I am getting that zest smell, but it smells like a, um, like a stale zest smell, if that makes sense. It could have it could be it could have something to do with the coriander seeds they put in it. Um, I really don't know because I'm not sure on coriander either. I haven't really tasted it. Um, let's taste it, shall we? Very. It's got a sweet, nice sweetness to it. Wow, that's not bad. It's actually like a, a fruit juice drink. It definitely got a cis, um Sorry, uh, can taste that citrus zest. Uh, I can't smell, I can't taste much more. I can t smell the beer and a little bit of the yeast. Um, but yeah, not a bad beer. Not one for me, I, I have to say. It's not not something I'll, um, I'll buy. I just bought it to try it. But, um, you know, guys out there, if you like a, um, a sort of a tropical tasting ale, this one's for you. Yeah, it's not bad. It's not, not ugly. It is a really good summer drink, that one. Um, probably would have been nice just to chuck a lemon on top or uh, something like a citrus, like an orange maybe, even an orange on top of this, to have it with it or throw it in there. Would have been nice. That's no, not bad. It's not ugly. Um, not one, I, like I said, not one I'd go out and drink. This beer is a beer made from, uh, by Grand Ridge Brewery in Merbourne North, near my area. They took over West City Brewery a few years back, I think, or a while back anyway, I'm not sure exactly. And uh, been producing these beers secondary. So if you look up on the screen, if you can see that, it has uh, Grand Ridge Gippsland Gold. I'll pop a picture of it anyway on the screen so you can see it. Grand Ridge Gippsland Gold uh, Old World Pale Ale, which is next to it, which to me looks like it could be the same one. I'm not sure if they're doing the same thing. So I'm going to 
try and get a hold of that and maybe get a hold of the West City Brewing, compare them and see if they're the same thing. But anyway, thank you guys for watching this little tasting video. Uh, I'm making a, like a VB clone again, recommended by one of my subscribers. And I thought I'd buy it when we had lockdown. I couldn't go anywhere, so I bought this and they shipped it out to me within a day. So it was actually awesome. So thanks for watching, thanks for subscribing, thanks for being part of this whole mess of things that I do. And uh, we'll see you in the next one. Cheers, guys.